Welcome to our lecture online. Now let's take a look at the graphical representation of the hyperbolic cosine. We now know that the hyperbolic cosine of x can be defined as e to the x plus e to the minus x divided by 2. If we now graph the first half of that, 1 half e to the x, we get a function that looks like this. It's the exponential function that crosses the y-axis at 1 half. If we then graph the second half of that, we have y equals 1 half times e to the minus x, so we get a function that looks like this. It's basically this function flipped over, crossing to the uh, point y equals 1 half. And then if we add those two together, after all, that's what we do here, then we can see that the red line here represents the sum of those two functions, which represents e to the x plus e to the minus x divided by 2, which is therefore the hyperbolic cosine of x. Notice that when we add these together, we cross over at y equals 1. Notice it's an even function. The domain goes out to infinity, and the range starts at 1 and goes out to infinity in that direction. So that's how we can see graphically what the hyperbolic cosine of x looks like. And that's how it's done.